Hey guys, what's up? James or Wizite here and welcome back to another Destiny video and in today's video I am going to be explaining to you guys and giving you guys the hints, tips and the rundown on how to kill Sepix Prime. Now he is the final boss in the Devil Lair Strike, um, the only one available in the beta at the moment. But first and foremost, what you want to do is you want to run downstairs and you want to open up that loot crate because that is then going to give you a weapon and sometimes it can be a, uh, a heavy weapon that is normally a machine gun or a rocket launcher um, and it can do like I, th I think it can do about five to six hundred damage each time you shoot Sepix Prime. Now moving on from that the second point is to stay spread out. I would in fact have two people up top one person underneath purely because Sepix Prime spawns some people underneath um, some of the drop shits come in and spawn people down there or drop people off underneath as well um, And also it allows Sepix Prime to target three different areas So when he targets a guy to your left and you're standing on the right You can get a clear shot without being hit and the same when he targets on the right or the left The person underground can also get a clear shot on him without getting hit this also leads on to uh, probably one of my third points being um, when two people are down, you definitely don't want to run out into the open and trying to revive them. Just wait the 20 to 30 seconds that it is um, and, and, and wait for them to spawn back in automatically because the minute that you die while two people are down, you have to start the whole mission again um, or, 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 or you have to start the whole boss again, shall I say, uh, and all of your hard work like getting him down to half health then restarts and he will have full health again. Now we have the basics, let's start talking about how you're actually going to kill him. As you can see on screen now, you get the critical hits from shooting him in the center uh, of his, he looks like an eye, but he's obviously not an eye. Um, but if you shoot him right in the middle, that is where you're gonna get critical hits. So you wanna use your sniper, then you wanna use your heavy weapon. And once you're out of your heavy weapon, ammunition you then want to go and use your primary weapon in this case i'm using a uh, scout rifle but when i get the chance i use my supercharger now the supercharger doesn't do as much as the sniper but you definitely want to do it as often as you can so in this point you want to shoot him in the middle of the eye with your sniper rifle then your heavy weapon then your uh, main weapon and then when you can shoot him with your supercharger and then the next point I have for you guys is kill the grunts that are laying around the map. Um, purely because these guys can do a lot of damage, um, especially the vandals. The vandals can really hurt. And when there's a lot of drags, when there's a group of drags, um, they can definitely take your health down quite rapidly as well. Um, also, when you do kill them, you will then pick up ammunition and replenish your ammunition, which will then allow you to snipe. Um, the Sepix Prime. So this is my top five tips for you guys. Tip number one, open the loot crate downstairs to get yourself a heavy weapon. Two, don't stay bunched together, spread out, otherwise Sepix Prime can pick all three of you off very, very quickly. Three, when two teammates are down, don't risk reviving them because you'll have to start the boss again. Four, shoot Sepix Prime in the center because that's his critical spot and that's where you'll deal most damage. And number five, kill all the grunts ASAP as they can deal a lot of damage as a group. It's been James Wizard, guys. Thank you all for watching. If this video has helped you out, please do leave me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment and let me know if you've already completed Sepix Prime. And also, don't forget to check out the links in the description for your chance at winning a Destiny beta code for either Xbox or PlayStation systems. Thank you all for watching. As always, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Click the image on the left to see an insane Destiny kill feed that I got on new map Mars. Click the image on the right to check out my video covering the Iron Banner equipment and most importantly, that amazing cloak that you guys can get. Click the link at the top to subscribe to my channel for more Destiny content. And don't forget to follow me on Twitter, Twitch and Facebook. All the links will be in the description.